Well, back here in mid Michigan after Michigan State's baseball team picked up two wins against Penn State on Friday and Saturday. The two teams met on the diamond once again with the Spartans looking to pick up their first Big Ten sweep of the season. Face paint, popcorn, and a hot dog. Now that is a good day at the ballpark for these kids. Nick Ferrazzi was on the mound to start for MSU, and he had a tough afternoon. Bobby Marsh launches a two-run bomb here, his second of the game. Ferrazzi gave up a trio of two-run homers, all to left-handed hitters, as Penn State built a 7-0 lead. But here comes MSU in the bottom of the fourth. Jack Frank singles into left, and Christian Williams races home, part of a five-run fourth inning. The Spartans came all the way back to tie it at seven, now trailing eight to seven in the eighth. Nick Williams comes up clutch, dropping in a bloop single to score Frank and tie it up once again as MSU just refused to go away. But in the ninth, Penn State delivers one more crushing blow. Bryce Molinaro drives a three-run homer the opposite way, the fourth home run of the day for the Nittany Lions as they top MSU 11 to nine, spoiling the Spartans' hopes for a sweep. Over on the softball diamond, MSU had a chance to pick up its first Big Ten series win, but this one got away from the Spartans in a hurry. Nobody out in the first. Paige Berkmeyer lays down a perfectly placed bunt into no man's land. Kelly Riono comes in all the way from second to open the scoring. Then Abby Reinick laces a single into center. One run scores easily, and Berkmeyer beats the throw home as well. 3-0 fighting Illini. Still in the first, Sydney Malott lifts a long fly into left, but check out the catch Janae Wash makes right in front of the wall. A great catch, although another run would score on the sack fly. A five-run inning for Illinois proved too much for MSU to overcome. The Spartans fall 6-3 to the final.